Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to West Highland Micro Adventures. Uh, we've just received the front runner base deck for the 2018 onwards Suzuki Jimny. So we're going to be installing that. Comes with three bars, one underneath there, two base deck plates, which are carpeted, and a set of instructions here. And a packet of screws signed by, as always, somebody. I think we've got Pearl this time. And so we're gonna put this together. Doesn't say how to take the base deck, um, sorry, the seats out. So we'll look at doing that first. Okay, so what we did here is we gave the seat a sharp pull up and pulled it forwards. That revealed these here. So I've just taken apart the pressure sensors from the seats, which is just using a flat headed screwdriver, push it up and pull them out. So then the seat unit comes out. Uh, it's revealed all these bolt heads that we're gonna have to take off seat belts and then take the seats out as a unit. So we'll get doing that now. So that's got all six down to uh, loose now, finger tight. And just about to undo the seat belt, two harness sides there and there. So that's the seat belt that's taken off now and dangling there. I'll secure them later. All these are loose, finger tight. Now I'm gonna take these final two little clips out there and there. That's them two removed now, that's them two bolts removed. This looks like it should just slide underneath, so as long as that's pretty loose on its threads, as is that one, it should just slide out. I've put the retaining bolts back and back for the seat belts, so they don't get lost when this is in storage. And these two here need to finally just lift out. Incidentally, these rear two here were hidden by these little plastic things. They sit on there and they just pop straight up. They're held in place by these little uh, white retaining clips. Hidden under here, you have to give this a short pull up and a little pull back. And you've got two more bolts that you need to get into there and get them straight out. That piece comes apart in two. So you have the front piece here, pulls forward. The rear piece there, you can see how it's retained. The seats should then just lift out singly. So these little M6 cage nuts. Now these go onto all these little square pieces here and here on every one all the way around. So um, there's quite a few of them. Okay, this front bar, which is the different one, is to secure across here to the seat pillows using the bolts provided in that gap there. My socket will not reach. That's them nice and nipped up there. And 
just point out that there is actually a subtle difference between these two that I thought were the same. That one there has got obviously two holes in it and that one there is for the rear section. So these middle sections, you literally just loosen them off, uh, sit in the positions, tighten them in, and we'll go around afterwards and give them a good tighten. And the last piece we've got here, sits that way, and as you can see down there, and that will be using the four bolts that I had left over there. Okay, so that's the main bars all in position. Now I'm just gonna go around and nip all these up. So that is now all bars securely fitted in place and nipped up. So now it's a case of fitting the two boards. Oh. So not one. One. Bad, and I'll just get screwing them down with the uh, bolts provided. Try an Allen fitting bolt. Okay, so all the holes are marked at the back, but they've carpeted over them. So you just take a drill and just go through the hole. See so if you be able to find it on the other side without causing any rips or tears. On this side and the last one. On here. They're hitting quite well. Just give this a little hoover now and tidy up. And that is pretty much done.